Okay, we're gonna play a little game together. We're gonna play the game of greed. The reason I wanna do this is because I wanna generate a quick set of data so that you can see me sketch a stem and leaf plot in real time. Because with that last example, when we were talking about the athletes and their daily protein intake, that's all fine and good. But I tend to feel students have a bit of confusion in terms of, well, how would I determine what my stems were? Like, how did you know to put one, two, and three? So I just wanna show you um, how I would construct a, a stem and leaf plot in real time. And you have to imagine, I, I typically do this in a classroom where there are 30 to 40 students, so I'm going to generate 30 to 40 data points. We don't have a classroom of students right now, so I am going to fake it. I have my little Star Wars figurines, so these in a moment will become our, our three students. So I'll show you how to play this game pretending I was these three students, and then I will just make up the remaining 27 data points. So let's take a look at the game of greed. This, this has nothing to do with statistics. This is just a fun game. If you're going out this weekend and things get a little boring, just be like, oh, what's up? Let's play the game of greed. I got a dice. So in a moment, I'm gonna have everyone stand, and you can't see me doing little air quotes, by everyone, I'm gonna have my three little little toys stand up, and I'll show you what I mean. I'm gonna throw a dice twice and total the numbers. All right, and that will be everybody's current score. So I'm gonna roll this die twice. Whatever pops up, great. I will add those two numbers together, and that will be our starting score, okay? If any student, any of my three little students are happy with that score, they will sit down, they've finished this round, and they will record their score. For anybody else who is still greedy, and again, this is called the game of greed, I will roll the die again, okay? So, for those that are still standing, they get to add this new number to my total, unless it's a two. If it is a two, the game is over, and those who are left standing will receive a zero for that round. I will keep throwing a die until two comes up, so those standing will get that score of zero, or, or until everybody has sat down and recorded their score for that round. We're gonna go five rounds, and at the end of the game, the students with their uh, students will add their five scores up to get their total. Okay, so I know this sounds like a lot, but here we go. So I'm gonna scooch this up so I can keep track of the scores. All right, so again, we're gonna play this game five times. So I'm gonna do, we're gonna have round one, round two, round three, round four, and round five, whoops. Okay, here we go. So I'm gonna put my three students here. Can we see them? Oh, I might have to scooch this down a bit so we can see that. Can I get round one in there? I think so. There we go. So we got Lando, we got Han, and we've got, well, Princess Leia is somewhere there. I don't wanna spoil it too much if you haven't seen the movies, but She's pretty awesome. Okay, so let me roll this dice twice. So I get a one. Ooh, and I got another one. That's unfortunate, but here we go. So I only have two points to start that, that first round out. So they are still, oops, sorry, Lando. They are still standing, okay? So they have the choice. They can keep this score of two by sitting down or they can keep on going. And score of two isn't too much, so they're gonna keep on going. Ooh, and this time I rolled a six. So I take my current score and I'm gonna add six to it. So now round one is up at eight, okay? So now Lando, Han, and Leia, they could sit down and write eight down for their round one score. And if they do, great. And if they're greedy, they stay standing. So the three of them are saying, well, eight isn't too much. I'm gonna stay up for at least another round. So I rolled, ooh, I rolled another six. So the round one score, let's do eight plus six, it's currently up to 14, okay? Now, Han and Lando are gamblers. Leia has some sense, so Leia's gonna sit down, okay? And I'm gonna record Leia's score here. Leia for round one earned a 14, okay? All right, so let's keep going. So what do Lando and Han have? They got a five. So we are up to 19, okay. They're gamblers, they wanna go one more round, at least. Three, 
All right, we're at 22. So Lando's saying, you know what, I've had enough. Lando's gonna sit down and I'm gonna record Lando's score as 22. Okay, so we've got Leia at 14, Lando at 22. Now Han's gonna stay standing. Keep in mind, if I roll a two, then he gets a zero. So let's see what I'm getting. Oops, a three, so he's at 25. And there it is, I rolled a two, so Han gets zero for this round. And the round is over. So, so far, all right, if I look at my scores, Lando's got 22, Han's got zero, Leo's got 14. Okay, and we're gonna do this four more times. So let me get the starting number. Let's see what we got. We got a four and a three. So our start for round two is at a seven. Okay, and you can watch me do this the whole time. All right, we've got all three of them standing. Here we go, five. They're gonna stay up. Ooh, six, 18. All right, Han's gonna sit, because he got zero last time. So let's record Han has an 18. Ooh, six. Six. All right, Leia's gonna sit. She's happy with that. So she's gonna get 30. Lando's gonna stay up. Ooh, three. He's gonna stay up one more round. There's a one, so he'll take a 34. He doesn't want to risk it anymore. 34 is a lot of points, so he's gonna sit, and we'll say that the round is over. So he earned 34 points, okay? So if we look at our standings just after two rounds, Lando's out ahead, Han's okay with 18, and, and Leia's somewhere there in the middle. All right, round three. Let's see what our starting numbers are. Ooh, six. Ooh, you can't see it, five. So round three is gonna start with an 11. Okay, here we go. Let me get our three players. And again, I want you to imagine this would happen in a classroom. Okay, three. I think they're gonna go, oops, two. So everybody gets a zero on this round. Okay, let's try round four. We got a four and another four. So we're starting this round with eight. Okay, here we go. Got a five, so we are at 13. I'm gonna go, I think everyone wants to go one more. Oops, a one. So we are at 14. All right, Han's gonna go ahead and sit. He still needs the points. So Han is gonna take 14 on this. Another one. So the tally is at 15. Leia's gonna go one more round. Oops, another one. She wants to go one more round again. One wasn't enough to get her to sit. Five. She is at 21, and that's gonna be enough for her. So we will record her score. 21. And Lando's gonna go two more rounds. He got a three. And, oh. He got the two, so he took a zero on this round. All right, so you can see the standings so far, and this is our last round. So here we go, Han's got some ground to cover up. I think Leia's doing the best out of the three of them, but it's pretty close between Leia and Lando. 
So we're starting with a three and a four. So this last round is starting with a seven. All right, so let's take a look. Let's get our three players up. All right, oops. They're all standing, here we go. Three. All right, so it's a 10. Han's gonna stay up, he's way behind, so he's gotta hope this is a good roll. Four. 14. Okay. One. Okay. Six. All right, Leia's gonna take the gamble. She's gonna sit down with 21. So we'll total these out in a moment, but Leia's done. Han's gonna still go. Five. Another five. Lando's gonna stay up two more. He thinks if he need, he can get two more totals, he may be able to beat Leia. There's one. I'll go 32. And let's see what he's got. And he rolled a three. So he's gonna sit down with 35. Han's gonna keep on going. We'll see if that was enough to win. All right, Han has to go for a long time. Ooh, six. Oh, sorry, Han. There's your two. All right. So let's see how everyone's doing and who wins this. Okay, so Lando had, let's go here. Lando had 22 plus 34 plus 35. So he came out with 91. Okay. Han didn't do so well. He came out with 32, he was a little too greedy. And Leia, what did she have? 14 plus 30 plus 21 plus 21. She had 86. All right, so of the three folks that we simulated right here, we had 91, 32, and 86. So in a moment, when we go to the next page, I'm gonna fake like I had a whole bunch of other student data and then I want you to watch me make a stem and leaf plot in real time. All right, so I wanna show you what it's like to draw a stem and leaf plot in real time. We have uh, Lando, Han, and Leia's scores, and then I just faked. I really actually used my random number generator to get 17 more student scores. So I have about a class of 20 students, right? So we're just gonna say here, this is a class of 20 students. And this was the game of greed. We'll just keep that in mind. Okay, so if I wanted to create a stem and leaf plot, the first thing I want to do is get this data in my calculator and put it in order. So let me get my calculator fired up. I'm going to do some data entry, got to clear out that list, and let me get these 20 data points in here. got that in there and again if I, I always check my first blank entry is my 21st cell and that's a good thing I should have 20 students in there so I should have 20 data points and I want to get this in order so let's see how we're doing with that go back to my home screen right? and then I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna hit stat and this time I like to sort ascending I'll hit number two and tell it to sort L1 okay so after I've done that let me go back into some data entry and it looks like I'm going from 14 to 133. So I'm gonna have a pretty long set of stems. And just based on how these numbers go, I think I'm gonna go by tens. Because 14 to 123, that, that spends a lot, spans a lot of digits. So I'll go by tens in this problem. So I'll come back to that in a moment, but I gotta make a pretty large stem and leaf plot. So let me just draw my stems down the middle. 
All right, so what do we say? 14 to 133, so I need... All right, so I've got my stems written out there, and here we go. All right, the first data point was 14, so I will put the four here. Looks like my next data point, I just have 21, and then I have 32 and 39, so I'm gonna put all three of those in there. 21, 32, and 39. Looks like I have a gap in the fours, and for the fives I have two, three, five for my leaves. For the sixes, I only have two, I have zero and five. Um, I have a 73 and 86, 73, 86, and we got 91 and 96, okay, then I jumped to 112, and if we're taking a look at 112 and 117, actually I have a few of them here, the, the stems here are 11, right? because it's 110 plus two to get to 112. So I have 11 tens and then a two of, for my leaf. 11 tens, 11 tens, excuse me, seven. 11 tens, seven. So here are my leaves, two, seven, seven, eight. Okay, looks like I have a 126, a 127, and a 133. So 126, 127, 133. So again, that's the beginnings of my stem and leaf plot. I'm going to erase this extra part down here. Uh, I'm going to put a title. And let me go ahead and make sure we know that this is stems, leaves. Okay. So for my title, again, I would say game of grade scores. And then pick any stem or any leaf to write your key. So I'll pick three and two. So three dash two, it equals the number 32 in this problem. 32 points, okay? If I was gonna start to write up my sentences, I'll use my little SOCKS acronym. We haven't talked about S, O, and C. We can come back to it, but for the spread, it looks like I went one for, or from 14 to 133. So I can write that, that the spread is 14 to 133 points. If I wanted to subtract those two numbers, I could find the range. So if I go back to my home screen, 133 minus 14, it looks like the range was 118 points. So again, I'm putting units on all of my statistics. All of your statistics, other than shape, outlier, center, and spread, they always have the same units as the units of your problem because they're data values. All right, so there's our stem and leaf plot. You can see I had some gaps. No one scored in the 40s. No one scored in the 100s. But it was 14 to 133.